Hello, I'm Ron Duker with Pyramid Air. Today we're going to talk about the Diamond Edge XT. This is a ready to hunt package, but stick around to see the extreme adjustability of this bow. This bow is the right handed camo riser option. It also comes in a right handed black riser option and a left handed black or camo riser option. This is a great bow for a beginner as well as an expert alike. It comes with a three pin fiber optic sight already mounted when you pull it out of the box. You'll have to sight it in. It also comes with a whisker biscuit already mounted. You'll have to make sure that it's tuned in. And then you will have to mount your octane stabilizer with strap. And you'll have to mount your four arrow octane quiver. The D loop is already tied in at the optimal position of the bow. This is where you're going to clip in with your release. It also comes with a three string split peep sight. This is a ready to hunt package, although it does not come with arrows. There's a reason for that in vertical archery. You need to go and select your arrows based on your draw weight and your targeted arrow length, individual to you as the archer. The base weight of this bow is 3.7 pounds, which is a little bit on the light side compared to other bows out there. You're going to see that it has a 31 inch axle to axle measurement, as well as a 6.75 brace height. The lighter weight of this bow is really important because you're looking at extreme adjustability. This goes anywhere from 19 inches of draw all the way to 31 inches of draw. It also goes from only 20 pounds of pull to 70 pounds of pull. This bow coming out of the package is going to be already bottomed out. What that means is right here you're going to see that this is flush with the riser. The reason why the limbs are flush with the riser is that's your 70 pound setting. So this is going to be as hard to draw out of the gate and then you crank back an equal amount of turns, a very important equal amount of turns on the top and the bottom so that your bow stays in time in order to lighten the draw weight as you go. If you're adjusting the draw weight yourself at home, you want to make sure that you keep an eye right inside of this little visual port right here. The reason for that is you do not want that screw to come backed out of this bushing any more than what you can see inside of there. If you do, your limbs can separate from your riser and you'll be going to a shop. This bow comes with two cams as well as yoked cables. When you go to make an adjustment, it goes anywhere from 19 inches of draw length to 31 inches of draw length. This one specifically came at 28 inches to begin with. If you need to make an adjustment up or down, make sure that after you make the adjustment and before you pull the string back on the top cam, you also make that exact same adjustment on the bottom cam before you pull the string back. This bow has a pre-installed carbon fiber shaft string stop that is adjustable, as well as on the cams, you will see a draw stop as well, corresponding in the top and the bottom cam. This bow set at the maximum draw, draw weight of 70 pounds and draw length of 31 inches shoots around 300 feet per second. And as you make adjustments down on your draw length or your draw weight, you're going to be reducing that as you go. Thanks for checking out the Diamond Edge XT. Don't forget to check us out on PyramidAir.com. I'm Ron Duker. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you next time.